dangers of skipping this video to watch another video come on these are things that we find people taking likely but for you it's an investment you should pay attention to because your life must not look like every other person's life you should take a new shape as you're hearing this welcome to the third edition on the finance life of a music mind today we'll be talking about managing maintaining and multiplying wealth managing maintaining and multiplying wealth the three m's and under this we're going to be looking at how to turn five thousand naira to fifty thousand naira. how to turn 5k to 50k have you ever asked yourself the question how do people get rich or wealthy in turning 5k to 50k the key word here is value in turning 5k to 50k the key word is value it's going to be very fast so listen and catch as much as you can even as we go on this short journey here the 5000 era is your investment note that i'm not talking about putting into any site putting into any um what they call it any money making um platform 5k here is your investment just notice this follow me carefully the second thing before the 50k is the key or the substance which is the main deal which is what i call the main deal and that is your value the third thing here is the 50k and the 50k is is a result of 50k plus is the success on implementation branding and successful sale of the value so you have a product here which is the value and the 50k is the result of the success on implementation branding and successful sale of that value okay so right here you have a product which is the value and um the success of the sale which is the 50k or more okay so here are some questions you need to ask yourself to be able to define what is this product the value you're supposed to sell you have to ask yourself who am i this question is a very important question you need to ask yourself who am i one of the crises many people are facing in the world today one of the most it's not disaster it's it's not it's not sorry it's not hurricane it's not earthquake they are not the most disasters that that, that, that is happening around the world today one of the most disaster people have in their lives is called identity crisis people do not know themselves it's what the society makes them but what have they come to the defining of who they are so you have to define who you are who are you two what do you have what do you have when um elijah met with a woman and told her what do you have in your house and that's what she answered was she has just a bottle of a jar of oil and through the jar of oil god used the jar of oil that simple jar of oil to bless her imagine the multiplication that came from just the jar of oil you have to ask yourself what do you have what can i offer to my world that's another that question you need to you need to ask yourself what do i know okay so what do i have what do i know okay what is my purpose what can i offer my world whether in exchange for extra value or in exchange for money what can you offer your world so these five questions are very important there's a percentage system there's a percentage system for multiplying wealth in your hand okay so there's a percentage system i call it the spiritual system for multiplying wealth for music mind so for multiplying any money that you make the first principle okay and which is i call them i call this one the spiritual principle is titan okay so if you're faithful in little it's as easy as that if you're faithful in little you'll be afforded more okay if you're faithful in little 10 percent of whatever you make it's it's easy to keep it might be hard at the beginning but when you create a culture out of it you find out that your boss asking for 10 percent of 100 okay asking for 10,000 out of 100k he gave you will will seem like a challenging idea but when you know you will be getting more from him you'll be able to give him the 10,000 
So have that mindset that the God that gave you 100,000 naira can give you 10 times, times 10 of the 100,000 naira. Okay? All you need to do is implement some principles, follow his direction, and you get it. So, if you're faithful in little, you'll be afforded more. The second principle is the percentage principle of income. Percentage principle of income. It's called the 10, 20, 70. 10, 20, 70. So 10% again goes to your tithing. 20% again goes to your savings of any amount you receive. And 70% goes to continuous investments. Now, this, I'm going back now to the 5,000 that I talked about on investments at the beginning. 5K investment is continuous investment in one purpose. Two, self. Yourself can be academics. Yourself can be growth in a particular business line, growth in a particular um, side hustle that you're thinking of. When I mean side hustle, I mean knowledge of the side hustle. Okay? So, in the part of the body, the place that has the most value or the most value is the brain. Okay? So, from there, the whole body operates. So, if you can invest in your brain, you can be able to multiply wealth. You can be able to multiply what you have already. So, continuous investment in purpose, your purpose, um, continuous investment in self, continuous investment in business, business, working systems, working systems, or a side hustle. In the beginning, it may look like it's not working, but if in a month or in 14 days of doing a particular thing, you can see profit. Please continue what you're doing. It only takes time. When I mean profit, I mean profit, not just revenue. Revenue is the total money you receive. When you remove the cost of what you of, of what you put in from the total money you receive, you now get your profit. Okay? So the total money you receive as income is your revenue. But when you remove the cost of whatever you did, you now get your profit. If you can see profit, then please continue doing it. Invest in it. The 70% is what should go to all this human investment. Know that. Not that your academics is inside, you know, what God has called you to do, which is your purpose, is inside, um, yourself is inside, your business is inside, okay? So, um, working systems or side hustle that you find yourself doing. So, these are systems whereby you can say, okay, I'm going to put in my 5K investment, 5K investment into. Now, when trying to multiply a particular amount of money to a greater amount of money. You have to understand that there's a factor that is called time. There are systems that work very fast according to how much you plan the time and the season and the study of the business um, feasibility. When I mean business feasibility, how much do your consumers need it? So, when I was talking earlier on, I said, the key here is value. And the 50K is as a success of implementation. Implementation now is the planning aspect. How much have you planned? You want to do a business, you want to go into something. You have not spent time to plan. How will it work? It is not magic. You have to spend hours of planning. You even plan while doing the business. You plan before the business. You plan after the business. This is how wealthy people, great minds, they spend time in the place of planning. That is why they have things that are called board meetings. Board meetings are strategy sections where they fix schedule or plans for greater success in the future. So, you have to take hours. If you can put in 20 minutes of your time every day into your future. You'll be shocked at what you will achieve in the next three years. I bet you. You'll be shocked at what you will achieve in the next three years because you will be so conscious. You will know the next step to take at any point in time. Any money that enters into your hand, you know exactly where it is going to. So, I've talked about the implementation. I've talked about the branding. People in the world pay for value. Whether rich or poor, they pay for value that is why um that is why you find people desiring a greater height than they are currently in nobody wants to go below where they are so 
at any stage you find yourself selling to the small community or selling to the big market, you have to know that your value is important. You have to brand right. Don't brand, don't over brand and brand yourself out of the market. But brand according to your identity, according to who you are. Brand, maximize it. Brand yourself according to who you are, what you can offer, your purpose, and what you know. So implementation, branding, successful sale of the value. This is where people get it wrong. So I will advise you, try to take courses, free courses, or go online and research on how to sell my value. There are a lot of ways. I can't start going into them now. Maybe during the live section, which we'll be having at the end of um, this edition or the end of this series on the finance mind of the music mind, we will get to have um, a live session where we'll talk about um, sales of the value. So the sales of the value is very important. After the ideas, after the implementation, you need to learn to sell the value. Sell the value. How to reach your target audience, how to convert your target audience, how to maintain and keep your target audience to be able to continuously patronize you, to be able to continuously reach out to you for the value you have to offer, the image you you portray in society and in business. So these are systems or these are ways on how to turn your 5k to 50k, how to um communicate or use the percentage system to your increase in your finance. I've also talked about the spiritual system for multiplying wealth for music mind. So please use these things to your advantage. Bend down and start implementation. If you ask questions, ask questions. We are ready to answer. I trust that God will bring the best even as you implement these ideas in Jesus' name.